Hello. Hi, how are you today? I'm fine. Yeah, that's how you do. I'm fine. Thank you. And you, that's how you start. Okay, so this is what we do today. Uh, we will just make some sentences. We try to talk. That's it. Simple. Okay, so uh, what time did you wake up today? Um. Oh. You understood, right? You understood. Good. What time did you wake up today? Um, I. Uh huh. Wake up. Okay. At eight o'clock. Okay. I wake up at eight o'clock. But one thing though, just one thing. My question was what time? Okay, I'll make it bigger. What time did you wake up today? So this is actually past tense. But wake is not past tense. You need to change it. Can you do that? Um. Well, I would say I woke up um. at eight o'clock today. Okay, perfect. That's how you do. All right, eight o'clock today. Oh, by the way, did you go to school today? Ah, uh, yes, I went to school. Yeah, you can answer now. Last time you couldn't. Yes, I went to school today. Really? I thought you don't really go to school today, but okay, anyways. Uh huh. Okay, yeah, it's fine. But my students, other students, they didn't go to school today. Mm -hmm. Did you? Did you really go to school today? Yes. Oh, you really went to school today. Okay, I thought today was public holiday. It was public holiday today. Do you understand public holiday? Yes. Okay, I thought it was public holiday today. Wasn't it public holiday today? Oh, yeah. So, wasn't it public holiday today? Or maybe school principals, they decide. Principals, do you understand principal? What is principal? I don't know. Okay. Principal is a person. Principal is a teacher, but the highest position, teacher. <laughs> so what is principal? <laughs> oh, yeah, that's right. So maybe your school principal chose not to take a rest today. I say here, uh, maybe your school principal chose not to take a day off today all right do you understand this sentence no okay then which part do you not understand here um Okay, good. Then I'll uh, I'll teach you what chose mean. This is chose or maybe 
easier way I would say choose then what about choose do you know choose um that's right and chose is the past tense of choose and the past participle is chosen choose chose chosen choose chose chosen all right that's choose chose chosen then what about this sentence i choose you pikachu i choose you pikachu what is it wait 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 i choose you pikachu i choose you pikachu what is it um well that is this is i choose you pikachu and maybe i can show you i choose you pikachu i'm pretty sure you can see it in where is it oh no not this that's how he says you know when, when, when he decide to go for a battle like a uh, pokemon battle he says i choose you pikachu and that's how he choose okay that's what it is then what about um okay then what about this can you make this sentence i chose mm -hmm. um my present present yeah present gift all the same is fine i chose my present I chose my present. Then what about this? I chose. Oh no, 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 no. That's passive boys. I chose. Oh no, I was chosen. Um, I was chosen. I was chosen. I was chosen. I was chosen. Then, okay, then what about this? Uh, This is the chosen one. The chosen one. The chosen one. The next is. Hmm. Can you make this sentence? This is the person chosen by me. The person chosen by me. The person chosen by me. Very, very difficult. I know. I understand. I'll teach you. It will be easy at the end of the class. So choose. Chose and chosen. And now we talk about this thing. This is very important right now. Chosen. So why is it so important? 
Let me tell you what. There are three ways. One. Okay. Mm. There are four different ways we use this. One. So I'll make a sentence. I have chosen my friend. What does that mean? I have chosen my friend. Oh, maybe my friends. Or I have chosen my... I have chosen... What do we choose? I have chosen... Okay, my present. What does that mean? I have chosen my present. Do you understand the sentence? Mm. All right, I'll do it. That's what it means. I have chosen my present. Okay, the second is my present. Was chosen by me. What is it? What does that mean? My present was chosen by me. Okay. Okay. Or you can also say this is okay too, but not that I mean you're wrong, it's fine. And three, three is adjective for the noun. Uh, the chosen friend. What is the chosen friend? Oh, no, 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 no. The chosen friend. Then what about the friend? The friend. What is it? Right. Then what about the chosen friend? Right. It's not a sentence. It's just a praise. And four is the friend. What is the friend? Okay. And what about the friend? Chosen by me. What about it? No.
this. Okay, this adjective, but it comes from this side, this side, but it comes from this side, different. But anyways, you can use them both. In your textbook, they use it a lot. So you need to understand why they use it and where they use it, how they use it. So there are only four different ways. 이거 굉장히 중요한 얘기예요. 지금부터 케이트가 교과서나 이런 데 보면서 이해 안 되는 문장들이 전부 다 이거예요. 이네개네개 중에 한, 이건 돼요. 이건 될 거예요. 아마 연습했으니까 이것도 될 거예요. 근데 얘두 개는 잘안 돼요. 아직. 그래서 선생님이 미리 어려운 걸다 만들어주고 그 다음에 지금 방향을 잡는 거예요. 오케이. 이쪽으로 우리는 오늘 많이 돌아오게 될 겁니다. Alright. Maybe your school principal chose not to take a day off today. So chose. Now you know chose not to take a day off today. What about other things? Is there anything you don't understand now? Oh, before that, let me ask you, how many percent do you understand when I speak in English now? How many percent? How many percent do you understand? Ah, uh, e 문장이요. No, 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 no. The whole class when I speak. Seventeen. Mm. Seventeen. Okay, so did you mean this this much? Seventy percent. Yes. Okay, or is it seventy? Which one is it? 17 or 70? 17. Uh, 17. Okay, don't worry. But what about the first class? 처음에는 17% 이하 아니었나요? 네. 조금씩 올라가고 있는 거 느껴요? 아니요. 어? 그대로예요? 그럼 17%로? 처음이랑 똑같이? 아, 그건 아니긴 한데. <웃음> okay, don't worry. You'll increase. And sometimes it's much and sometimes it's little, but still it will. Okay, maybe your school principal choose or chose chose not to take a day off. So what do you not understand here now? You understand chose and what else? What else? Oh, off today. Off today. Okay, you need to understand. Take a day off. The whole thing, okay? Take a day off. Take a day off. Take a day off. How do? That's take a day off. Okay. So maybe you can say, um, I took a day off yesterday. I took a day off yesterday. I took a day off yesterday. What is it? 나는 어제 쉬었다. Mm -hmm, okay, so a day off, which means yesterday you didn't work. Very good. Then what about this? Now you know, take a day off. So maybe your school principal chose not to take a day off today.
Ah, e u n y a n g Yep, yep. In Korean, what is it? Doneyakyo. Mm-hmm. Haru shinen kozu. Mm. But I said maybe. So the sentence is. That's my sentence. Okay. So maybe you don't understand. Choose not to. This one I'll teach you. So what about this? I choose uh, to study. I choose to study. I choose to study. And then, and take. I I couldn't hear you. Something. Uh, I I still can't hear you. Hata. Okay. All right. So I'll say it's uh just present tense. That's why. Okay, I choose to study. Then now I ask you, what about I choose not to study? I choose not to study. I choose not to study. Can you say again? Okay. I would say I choose not to study. It's actually better explanation. I mean, better comprehension here. Then what about I try? What is I try? I try. I try. Oh. I try. I try. Okay. So that's the sentence. Then what about I try to? Uh. I try to. Um, hang out with my friends. I try to hang out with my friends. I try to hang out with my friends. Um. What do you mean by hang out? Oh, hang out. Okay, great question. I like it. Hang out. Hang out is. That's hang out. Hmm. Then. 나의 친구들 
과 어울려 부르고 시도한다. Okay. Well, yeah, that's right. So, uh, to make it slightly more natural. Uh, okay, I'll just leave it like this. Okay, hang out. Hang out with. Hang out with. Okay, then what about I try not to hang out with my friends. Or maybe I'll say them. Or him. Or her. I try not to hang out with them. I try not to hang out with them. I try not to hang out with them. Oh. Um. What do you mean by them? Damn, aha, uh -huh, I see. Do you know they? What is they? Could they? Yeah, right. But you can't just say this way. You can say, This is they. And that is subject. But when we talk about them, this is more like this. And this is. That's them. Or it has one more meaning. This. Good. Okay. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. No, I would say that's the sentence. Okay, but anyways, you understand uh, not two sentences, and that's good enough. Okay. All right, good. Then my next question is, what did you do today? What did you do today? Fine. Fine. Oh no, come on. My question was, what did you do today? What did you do today? Do you understand? No. Oh. oh no, no is not an answer. You need to answer the full sentence. No what? I don't understand the... That's good. Okay, the sentence. Okay, that's good. I'll teach you. Don't worry. What did you do today? So what? What is what? Was there? 
Okay. Then now the next question is, did you do? What is did you do? In Korean, what is it? Did you do? Okay, but question, right? So, uh huh. This is did you do? Then now I ask you again. What did you do? What is this question? What did you do? Very good. So, what did you do today? What did you do today? What did you do today? What is it in Korean? Right. Okay, so now you can tell me. What did you do today? I go to school. Oh, but it already happened. So it should be past tense. Past tense, you can do it. I um goes. Oh no 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 go went gone. I went to school. Oh yeah, that's right. You went to school. What else? Do you understand what else? No. Okay, I'll teach you else first. Else. Else. This is else. So number four. So when people ask you what else? What else? What else? This is what else question. So now I know you went to school. I see. Then what else? And um, I went to. Uh, go academy. Oh, you can say I went to academy. I went to academy. Okay, was it math academy? Yes. Okay, then you could say you could have said I went to the the math academy, but okay, it's fine. All right, uh, you went to Math Academy. And what else? What else did you do today? You went to school, you went to Math Academy, and what else? Um, I drank water. Okay, you drank water. Why not? Good. So every detail is fine. You drank water. And what else did you do? Remember, what else did you do?
uh, I ate lunch. Okay, you ate lunch. That's great. Then, uh, what about dinner? Did you eat dinner today? Yes. I ate dinner today. Very good. Okay, you ate dinner today. So, how was your lunch? How was it? How was the lunch? Okay, there's one more thing that I want to teach you in case you know something in Korean. You know something in Korean, but you don't know that one in English, you can ask me this way. What is, uh, well, what is 교과서 in English? What is 교과서 in English? What is it in Korean? Yeah, right. So, is there if there is any word that you don't understand, then you can use this sentence. What is something in English? Okay. So, how was the lunch? How was the lunch? Do you understand the question? How was the lunch? How was the lunch? How was the lunch? No. Huh? Oh, so you don't understand. Okay. Then what about how? Do you understand how? Oh, no. How is, I can tell you how is. This is how. So how was the lunch kitchen is? Okay. All right. The question was, how was the lunch? So you probably didn't understand the how question. How was the lunch? Um, Can you be louder? I can't hear you. Good. Okay. Good is not an answer in my class. The 
The question was, how was the lunch? Then the subject is the lunch. Then you can use it. Um, the lunch is... Oh. No, but you need to make it past tense. You can say the lunch was good. The lunch was good. The lunch was good. Okay. All right. And the lunch was good. Uh, did you meet your friends today? Uh, uh, yes, I met. Mm -hmm. Friend. Today. So, today. yes, I met my friends today. Okay. How many friends did you meet today? Twenty nine. Twenty nine is not my answer. Not answer in my classroom. So you need to make a sentence. How many friends did you meet today? I met. Good. Twenty nine. Today. Twenty nine friends today. <laughs> Okay, so you met 29 friends today. And um, yeah, okay, so my next question is, did you hang out with your friends today? Mm. Yes, I... Hung out. Hung out mm -hmm. with my friends. Okay. Yes, I hung out with my friends. Yes, I hung out with my friends. Okay, and next. Next thing is, okay, how many friends did you hang out with? All right, the question was, how many? Do you understand how many? What is how many? Okay, how many friends did you hang out with today? How many friends did you hang out with today? How many friends did you hang out with today? And what is that in Korean? Ah. Uh, the he he so. Right, in Korean. 얼마나 많은 아, 오늘 Mm. Mm. Right. Perfect. Oh. 
from is hang out. Oh, what is hang out? Sorry, what was? It? Can you say again? Ah, uh, is hung out. Ah, when that is past tense is hung out. So hang, hung, and hung. Hang, hung, hung. Hang, hung, hung. But hang plus out is so yeah. It's hung out then. It's uh <gasps> okay. Did I just delete them all? Oh yeah. Fine. So in this case, I asked you past tense. You must answer. I hung out with. It's hung out. Twenty nine. Okay, in that case, you need to make a sentence, please. Today. Now, from the subject, you need to start the sentence with I. I hung out. Um. With, with, mm -hmm. my friend, but the question was how many. Many to Okay, what are you trying to say? Can you say that in Korean? Maybe I can help you kicker. And then next. What are you, Alibaba? <laughs> okay. I hung out with twenty nine friends today. That's how you do. I hung out with 29 friends today. I hung out with 29 friends today. I hung out with 29 friends today. Okay, yeah, good. That's how you'd say. And next, uh, what did you do with your friends? What did you do with your friends today? I don't understand. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, good answer. 
What did you do? Do with your friends today. What did you do with your friends today? What did you do with your friends today? Uh, um uh -huh. oh in korean first please uh, 당신은 당신의 친구들과 아, 그 오늘 당신은 당신의 친구들과 Perfect. Okay, you can answer now. Uh, I okay. Do homework with my friend today. Yeah, almost perfect. Just one thing. Tense. Past tense. Did. Yeah, right. I did. Okay, that's how you do. Make it better and better. I did homework with my friends today. I did homework with my friends today. Oh no, I don't have to put it here. I'll just make another one here. Okay. I did homework with my friends today. I did homework with my friends today. Hmm, I see, good. How long did it take for you and your friends to do your homework? So now, the question is, how long did it take? How long did it take? How long did it take? Do you understand that sentence, the question? Oh, uh, no. Okay, okay, fine. This is how long did it take question. So, how long did it take to do the homework? How long did it take to do the homework? How long did it take to do the homework? What is that in Korean then? Um... Yeah, but past tense. Okay, perfect. That's my question. And next question is, how long did it take for you to do the homework? How long did it take for you to do the homework? How long did it take for you to do the homework? Now we have for you. So what is it in Korean? Um, 당신... Uh, yes. Oh, no, 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 no. In this case, this is simple. Okay. Oh, but I said the homework. Simpler. 
I'll just put it this way. And what about how long did it take for you and your friends to do the homework? How long did it take for you and your friends to do your uh no. How long did it take for you and your friends to do the homework? How long did it take for you and your friends to do the homework? Now what is it? It's just the same thing over and over again. So I'm not gonna do it. How long did it take? Answer now. Can you answer? Uh We. We. Uh, take. Do um, the homework. All right, I give you the answer first. You can say, it took how long, how many minutes, or how many hours? Tell me. One hour. Okay, it took an hour to do the homework. But we need to tell someone that it's you and your friends, then maybe, ah, oh, no, it's fine. I'll just do it this way. It took an hour to do the homework. It took an hour to do the homework. Voila, this is how we do. It took an hour to do the homework. Then okay, now, now my next question is, how long did it take for you to finish your lunch? How long did it take for you to finish your lunch? How long did it take for you to finish your lunch? What is it in Korean? Um, 당신이 okay. 당신이 먹기까지. Oh well, what is finish? Okay, I'll just see. Simpler. Okay. Well, yeah, so you can answer now. It finished. Oh, no, 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 no. You always, always, always want to say it took. When it is about time, you it took. Mm. Mm -hmm. Um. Finish it. No, 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 no. It took time. How long? Um. Um, twenty minutes. Mm -hmm. It took twenty minutes to do what? 
to finish the lunch today maybe it took 20 minutes to finish the lunch today it took 20 minutes to finish the lunch today okay yep that's how you do so it's about time yeah then what else what else can i do nothing actually is good enough today is very good so maybe we can just try to see what we did today first not browse so this is how much i'm gonna put it as 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 urgent as possible reposition one good 64 cars and then let's see a little choose chose chosen what is choose chose chosen choose chose chosen choose chose chosen choose cho okay and else. next else what is else All right, fine. So something else, what else? The question is always just else, else, else. Hang out with, what is it? Uh, That's right. So you don't want to say you play with your friends, you hang out with your friends. Okay, good. Hang, hung, hung. No, it's not passive voice. This is hang. Okay, hang, hung, hung. How long did it take for you to do the homework? Perfect. Yeah, right. Else. Okay. Okay. How long did it take for you to finish your lunch? 당신이 uh -huh. 점심 식사를 끝내는데 얼마나 걸렸나요? Right. How long did it take to do the homework? 당신이 그 숙제를 Something like that. But for you, it doesn't exist here. So we are not asking who, but it's okay. It's okay. Still, you're understanding it perfectly. I like it a lot. Hang, hung, hung. Fine. It's just not How important long? now. Okay. So um, yeah, today we learned a lot of things. And uh, the most important thing for you is actually 제가 하는 말들을 이해하고 거기에 따른 행동을 해내고 있다는 게 되게 중요한 거예요. 전이랑 지금이랑 수업의 흐름 속도 자체가 달라요. 제가 볼때전 수업이랑 지금 수업이랑도 굉장히 다르고 점점 점점 지금 가파른 이렇게 경사로 이렇게 올라가고 있는 것 같아요. 솔직히 저는 오늘 수업에서 조금 잘 이해하고 있구나 또는 잘 따라오고 있구나라는 걸 굉장히 많이 느끼고 있거든요. 그리고 대답이 나오기까지 속도도 되게 빨라졌어요. 지금 본인은 못 느낀다니까요. 본인은 못 느껴요. 자기 배우는 사람은 못 느껴요. 근데 가르치는 사람은 이렇게 보여요. 다음 시간에 더 빨라질 것 같은데 이러고 나서 이제 수업을 몇회 정도 더 진행을 해본 다음에 옛날에가 아니라 이제 처음에 수업 진행했을 때로 가서 영상을 한번 보면은 그때 느낄 거예요. 아마 자기 자신을 제3자 입장에서 지금 이제 좀 발전한 상태에서 보면은 어? 저 때보다 지금 지금 저때 내가 못 알아듣고 있는 말을 나는 지금 알아듣는데 이런 감정이 들 거예요. 아마 그걸 위해서 모든 걸 제가 다 기록을 하고 있는 거예요. 상당히 많이 달라졌어요 오늘 그래서 제가 볼 때는 내일 모레 수업이 아니라 이번 주 금요일 날 수업이죠 
맞나? 수요일? 금요일 수업이죠. 그죠? 어, 그때 되면 굉장히 달라질 것 같기도 하고 숙제에 의해서 일단 오를 되게 잘했습니다. 수업은 여기까지 할 거고요. 혹시 모르는 거나 뭐 물어볼 거나 이런 거 있나요? 아니요. 어, 수업 아니라도 상관없어요. 평소에 카톡으로 그냥 모르는 거나 이런 거 이상한 거잘 모르겠거나 이게 왜 그런지 모르겠다 이런 거 있으면 그냥 물어보세요. 아무렇지 않게. 알겠죠? 수고했습니다. 잘했어요. 네. 감사합니다. 그래요.